Hello, friends. Today, we're going to talk about a VPN feature that many people don't know about, split tunneling, or simply selective traffic routing. In 2025, this feature is becoming increasingly important, especially if you want to balance security and speed. Let's start with the basics. What is split tunneling? Usually, when you turn on a VPN, your entire internet connection goes through an encrypted tunnel. All traffic, your browser, apps, background processes, Mickey the cycle runs through the VPN. Sometimes this isn't always convenient. For example, you may only need a VPN for streaming or work, while local apps, banking sites, or printers need to work directly without encryption or delays. That's where split tunneling comes in. This feature allows you to choose which programs, websites, or apps will work through the VPN and which will use your regular connection. Let me give you a few real-life examples. Let's say you connect to a U.S. server via NordVPN to watch Netflix U.S. At the same time, your online bank may block your login if it sees a U.S. IP address instead of your real one. With split tunneling, you can send Netflix through the VPN and let your bank work directly with your local IP address. Another example is an internal work network. You can connect cloud services or CRM through a VPN for security while leaving internal office resources outside the VPN to avoid overloading the channel. Another common scenario is torrent clients. You can configure torrents to go through the VPN for anonymity while all other applications work as usual. How does it work in NordVPN in 2025? In the NordVPN app, go to settings and enable split tunneling. Next, select a mode. Either specify which apps to exclude from the VPN or vice versa. Which apps must go through the VPN? On Windows and Android, this feature is available in full. On macOS and iOS, it works with limitations due to system policies, but some of the functionality has already been implemented through separate routes in the app. Why use split tunneling at all? First, it saves speed and resources. You don't send unnecessary traffic through encryption where it's not needed. Second, you'll have fewer problems with websites that don't like VPN IPs. Third, it's convenient for everyday use. You can work securely where it's critical and comfortably where it's not necessary. Why I choose NordVPN for split tunneling. First, it's very flexible. Second, high compatibility with different systems. Third, in combination with Nordlynx, even with active split tunneling, the speed hardly drops. Plus, all this comes with NordVPN's overall protection. Full no logs policy. Over 7,300 servers in 110 countries. Bypass any streaming blocks. Threat Protection Pro. Blocking malicious sites and ads. NordVPN's price for 2025 remains one of the most affordable. Two years, $39.99 per month. Plus three months free. Free ESIM with 10 gigabytes of data, protection for up to 10 devices, and a 30-day money-back guarantee. The bottom line is simple. Split tunneling is a smart way to finally control your security and comfort on the internet. NordVPN makes this feature as simple and stable as possible. Set it up and you won't have to worry about which sites go where. The link to NordVPN is below this video. All bonuses are in the pinned comment. If you found this useful, like, subscribe, and see you in the next episode of VPN Unlocked.